how that gets got. I wonder if it clips onto something so you can carry carry something else. I'm not sure with that. Tell me your thoughts about that one. Hydraulics. I don't think these panels are properly rendered in or whatever they're supposed to be. They're, they're untextured, so I think there's something to come there. And I don't know what that is, that black unusual it looks like it's a logo, but I think it's I think it might be a cluster that's not that's clipping. Can you see that one there? It's not clipping right, is it? Still a lot of work to be shipped. They are not finalised. Please bear that in mind that every ship we look at, even now, none of them are finalised. That's a nice shape, isn't it? Again, the styling for the 300 series, really cool, very, very nicely done. So what I'll do is I'll get back up and i see if I can just walk onto the wing and have a look further around the ship, see if we can spot anything interesting around there. I mean, it's, another thing about this is that it's, it's a nice interior, but it kind of has no use, unless some of these are going to be cupboards. These look like some of these may open up, like so I expect if you have an electrical fault, you'll have to go there and figure it out. Again, another oxygen supply there. We'll leave the cockpit for a second and we shall head out onto the wing, even though it clearly states no steps. But hell, we like to So yeah, this, again, a really nice shape to it. Hazardous voltage inside. Risk of electric shock or burning. Very nice. I think we should go and have a look at the cockpit now. Yeah, so let's go down. This does look like a really nice. Can you imagine actually with all these doors shut, just could waking up, closing your bed up, and thinking, right, let's get on and have a look out there and see whatever you can see out in space. Be it more ships going through a trading lane if you parked up during the Murray Cup race, you might be able to see that in the background. So I haven't spent much time in 300 series racing, etc. or even fighting. But I think it is a decent ship. Let's get rid of this and we'll have a look around the cockpit to see what we can see. So it's an unusual, I mean you can see my feet moving there. I'm not sure what that's for, I can't remember. I think that's your, I'm probably wrong, I'm just going to be quiet with that. But the steering wheel, well, the, the, the joystick or the controls are like a F Formula 1 racing car. They're not like your typical joy, joystick that we use on most of them, which would sort of lend itself to this controller. If you own one of these and the controller that comes out is going to be a single stick and throttle, maybe it's pointed thinking, you know, if you really just want to have a joystick like this. So maybe they may release different styles of joystick, I don't know. Let's ignore that for now. So you have all your warnings there, as normal. Somewhere in the middle, we'll have to take it to the arena commander and see what it looks like when it's all booted up. Again, so I think, aren't they? Oh no, no different warnings, that's good. So radar, fuel, heat, sensor, weapon, ammo, shield, comms, BRS. I don't know that one, someone. Life support, maybe for life, engine and avionics. These again will probably be placeholders for the moment. We've got a couple of red sticky switches there that sort of you do can switch. But all in all, a good a nice cockpit, nice nice view. Again a good 180 degree view. I don't know, we'll have to see where this 3D sphere radar sphere radar shows up and see if that gets in the way more than it should do, but Again, all subject to change. Anyway, let's get into Arena Commander and, and see how. So, in Arena Commander, it looks very, very sleek, very nice. So let's give it a little trial run and see how it. How it there's a Sunday on the squad waypoint, and there's one in the tower as well. Aren't they? So as we know, it's got 12 thrusters, so it should be very, very manoeuvrable. It's got a 
very high speed of 220. Um, boost doesn't seem to make any difference, but I'm sure it will do uh, once they've set it to do so. But yeah, to be honest, I've had a. Shield. I think it was a three. Was it a three, three tier shield? And it's only front and back, which I was quite shocked at. You would have thought in a ship like this it would be a really, really good shield, but you know to protect you against against the odds. But no, it doesn't seem to be. So let's take a look at it at it from from the outside. Sounds very similar to the 350 or the M50. Sorry, the M50 does sound very, very meaty, very meaty. Um, but this and, and this sounds like it's on rails, like um, it sounds like a scale electric, but a floating. Changed, I swapped that out for a different weapon during the Vandal Swarm. First, just looking at all these different space stations. But I think what we'll do is we'll take it for a little land and have a look at it while it's in space, and I'll show you the combustion. Question uh, pistol. It should be quite cool. So let's see how easy this is to land. Get a bit of speed up quite far away, and then I'll just, with it not having a good braking, that's not too bad when you're going slow. But so we have our squad at home. Sorry well. if you've ever seen any of the ship reviews and seen some nightmare of flying. Yeah, good job. Generator and I use the FP to go down rather than my straight. Okay, Shit. Shit, didn't want to do that. Oh no, I'm going to it up. I'm just trying to see how the wheels come out. the uh, softest landing. Things flying off in the distance. You'll be like, what should I do? So, we'll no, we'll get out and I'll show you this gun. There it is. Tell me your thoughts about the uh, 300, specifically this one, but obviously I'd like to hear about all the other ones as well. What, what's your opinion about the 300 series? And what is your favourite 300? That's a good question. I don't even know what mine is, I don't know the spec. I've really looked into them very much compared to other ships, because I don't own one, so it's not really into mine. But they are nice ships. Very good sort of personal transport for this quick A to B thing. But anyway, this is the pistol.
Ah, alright. Amen to that. I say amen to that, I do the same myself. Engineer in the area. Our mosquito spotted.
spotted a hostile infiltrator. Okay, this is GBX. We will do a galaxy drop on Sungray West to uh, retake that. So uh, we'll attempt to secure that, and then uh, if other outfits can let us know uh, where they are, we'll uh, work around Enemy that. Medic spotted. <laughs> 